Hello everybody, this is Derek with Reef Automation Tutorials on Neptune Systems. Today I'm going to go over profiles in the programming. Uh, profiles are generally used for overriding programming. Um, basically they're a quick um, programming method that allows you to take any of the outlets that you have in the system and have them quickly go to something specific. Um, Typically, you'll use profiles during timing of the day, uh, during feed modes, during any type of uh, device that requires you to quickly go to some type of percentage or some type of ramp, some type of lighting. Um, profiles aren't used very frequently, but they're nice to have when you want one of your devices to go to something and override the programming that's currently there. So let's get started. So... Profiles are very easy to find. They're in the folder icon. If you click on the gear and go to folder icon, you can see where all the um, all your profiles are. Now you'll already see I have a couple profiles here, so we're going to go over one of them called Light Pick. So Light Pick is connected to my Radeon. Now in order to use this profile, first of all you have to have a Radeon. Second of all, you have to have a WXM to control the Radeon. But this will control Radeon. There's a couple other ones in here. There's one for if you want to set up a doser to do something specific. There's one for if you have just a pump and you have a percentage of the pump you want it to go to. This is a ramp. Same thing as the pump, but this is ramping. Uh, you can also use ramping for lights. This is for if you have a Hydra. This is for if you have a Vortec pump. This is if you have a wave pump. And this is if you want to use weather, um, for instance, on your Radeon. So we'll go through each one of these step by step, but we're going to start with the Radeon. So you see I have a profile called Light Pick, and it has an intensity of 100 across the board. However, it has a starting intensity of 35 and an end intensity of 35 with a zero wrap time. So what this means is that if I go to this profile, it's going to set all of my intensities to 100 and a brightness of 35. This is roughly the same thing as a 10K light spectrum. So if I go to my main program and I have an office pick and I have a reef pick, I have a Radeon in both of those tanks, when I turn on my reef pick, I want that mode to happen. So this is a virtual outlet that's called reef pick. It's always off. But if I was to turn on the reef pick right here, it's going to change the spectrum and it's going to change to the profile, which, in, which is basically going to override the programming. Once you uh, have overridden the program, it's going to go back to the normal program once the profile is no longer selected. So here's my Radeon programming. You will notice that if Outlet Reef Pick is on, so if that virtual outlet is turned on, I want you to then go to this profile, which is Light Pick. Once I've turned off this profile, it's going to go back to the normal program. So again, profiles are generally used for overriding a program. So if we go back to our profiles, we have a couple different ones, like I was saying. So we have a pump. So we have a pump. Synchronize means that it's going to synchronize the off and on time no matter what. Divide by 10 is going to divide the on and off time by 10 so it can be in seconds because as you can see these are on minutes so if I say divide by 10 this is going to divide one minute by 10 so it's going to be um, whatever that would be which I think would be 10 seconds so this is if we had a pump and we wanted it to be off for an initial time which generally you wouldn't you'd want it to be off for no time you want it to be on let's say for five minutes um, and then you'd want it to be off uh, for, oh, this is seconds. So it's going to divide by seconds. I apologize. So if you put 60, it's going to, if you put divide by 10, this becomes six seconds instead of 10, uh, 60 seconds. Um, so that's what divide by time or divide by 10 means. So it's going to be on for five seconds, off by for five seconds, and this is the intensity that you will put it. The minimum intensity is when it's off, and the maximum intensity is when it's on. And again, this will override any pump settings that you have. Um, it can be just a regular pump that you have, and it has a V control or a 10-volt control, and you want it to override whatever the programming is for a set amount of time. This would be where you use pump. Dose, same thing. Dose just gives you a dose rate. Uh, you put in your 
rate at which you'd like to dose, uh, if you'd like it to go forward or reverse, and how much. And again, this is for the dose for your um, Neptune dose to override whatever it's doing currently with a profile. You also have the uh, radion, or I'm sorry, the ramp. So the ramp is just if you want to ramp something for some reason. Let's say you want a light to ramp from 10% to 50% when you hit a button. That's what the ramp profile would be. Uh, Vortec and um, Radeon are very similar. You just put in what you want them to be. If you have a Vortec, again, you have to have a Vortec pump and a WXM. But if you have one, then you're going to um, put the specific uh, mode that you'd like it to be on and what you, the intensity you'd like it to be on, and it will completely override the program that you're, that you're using currently. Same thing with a wave. And weather we're not going to really get into. Most people don't use weather, but basically this will put in a weather timing into your Vortec um, at a specific time. You can have it go to that profile. Again, profiles are overrides. So if you go to your main program and you want something to happen, if I went to my dose, for instance, and I go over to uh, Refido, and this is what it's currently doing all day, and I want it to at some specific point of the day to override it if time you know at uh, let's say eight o'clock to ten o'clock I want you to be in a profile light slow isn't the profile but you can see what I mean then it's going to override the programming and use the profile so that's generally what profiles are used for um, if you have any questions or comments, just leave them below and I'll try to get to them. Um, also, please like and subscribe to the channel if you liked the video and hit the bell to be notified when I do new videos. I also do live streams every week, so um, please be sure to get the notifications so you can be as part of the live streams and I give away stuff during that time as well. Again, thank you for watching and have a great day.